Hello everybody, Chris Wood here. I'm just doing a quick update. I am completely and totally numb. I have no feeling in the right side of my head whatsoever. It feels like a liquid moving up through the back of my neck to the right side of my occipital lobe. It's coming up around to my temple area and up here and spreading all around my head. It's all starting on the right side. I have been brain split. I have been skull split. I have been brain split. I have been right side, right lung damaged, right kidney damaged, basically my right side. Medical treatment refusals, medical blacklisting, lies, time buying, cover-ups, arrest refusals, false arrest, kidnapping, sex assault, my mother stalked and murdered, my dog Chipper murdered, arson attempts on my previous address, blood throwing on my previous address, arson threats where I am now, false arrest, kidnapping, Lennox and Annexon, Ontario Provincial Police, Spencer Mills, 14716, ex-chief or commander who had me shot back in 2019 before he left at my previous address on the corner of Sutter and Bridge in August of 2019. It was approximately 3 p.m. in the afternoon. Shannon Cork, staff sergeants, years 2019-2021. Robert Kane, Robert Lucas, Stacy, a mental health worker, was Napanee Daily Tea Company, now Kingston, and Shelly Hafner, or Huffner, OPP, mental health worker. Human trafficking, human sex trade slavery trafficking, children to pedophiles, adults to sex offenders, identity thefts, financial thefts and frauds, framings, blood and piss stealing, false arresting to get pictures, print signatures to criminalize their victims to get away with the crimes in an attempt to get away with the crimes that they're getting away with. Lies about being suicidal self-harmers so that way when you're injuring them and torturing your victims and they end up being killed, you can use that as a narrative hoping it's going to be believed or drugs or whatever because of who it's coming from. The doctors, the cops, mental health using their badges, positions, their lies, false guys of law, credentials, in hopes to be above suspicion and to get away with the crimes. Poor, homeless, elderly, disabled, beware, because once they cast their lies against you and they know that you cannot fight it monetarily or any other way, you're screwed. They've assured this. They murdered my mother. They murdered my dogs. I am the end of my bloodline. All it would take would be an MRI or some actual medical tests to prove the damages done to me. I had no neurological problems, brain problems, or any other problems which I've been speaking of prior to this happening to me after I was shot. Given CAT scan results away at the hospital, Dr. Tatiana V. Lennox and Addington Hospital is involved, obviously, criminally with negligent and intent, covering up for themselves, for OPP, and for their boss, Billy Woldridge, the one known as Billy Woldridge, a Wannett Harbored sex offender, child stalker, pedophile, approximately 73 years old, Thinks that he is me, thinks that we were switched at birth, believes that he is Harry Potter. Blair Hardy, drug trafficker, rapist, drug lacer, allegedly has a meth lab in Tweed, Ontario with Spencer Mills, OPP 14716, and Robert Kane, drug cops. They are associated to Russell Williams still. OPP is, and so is Billy Waldridge. Copycat pieces of shit. I am 50 years old. I spoke police crimes, and I am an identity theft, revenge retaliation, complete identity change, end of my bloodline, 
OPP and the rest of you pieces of shit because I cannot get a rest done. We can always go and exhume my bod my dad's dead body to prove my DNA if need be on your dime and you will be the one doing it because this is on you doing this through you.